the hormones, for example, um, huge interactions between the sex steroid hormones and neurotransmitters. So, for example, we know that progesterone helps support GABA. Um, we know that oestrogen can help support dopamine. And so if people's sex steroid hormones are out of balance for whatever reason, and again, the genetics can tell us these, these tendencies, these you know, innate, natural kind of start points, then we can understand why and how that can impact their, their neurotransmitter balance as well. Um, and it may be that some people's hormones are absolutely complementing their neurotransmitter profile for a whole period of their life. And then something happens, it could be pregnancy, for example, huge time of hormone shifting. Um, and we know that some people experience postnatal depression big hormone shift, huge plummet in oestrogen. And guess what? That's that's like pulling the rug from under your dopamine. So is it just dopamine or also serotonin? It's serotonin. Yeah, serotonin as well. Yeah. When you look at them, it's you could you could on the pathways put the the hormones as cofactors and helpers kind of but embedded in those neurotransmitter pathways, they are so interrelated.